prioritizing high risk groups on paper is not effective if those individuals are not able to act actually access the vaccine. Underserved, hardworking communities in my district lack clinics and providers. Many people in my district don't have access to broadband to schedule a vaccine online. They don't have hours to spend on the phone trying to get an appointment. They don't have transportation to the vaccine site. They don't have access to information in a language they understand to help them navigate the system. I saw those issues firsthand yesterday when I went to a collaborative nonprofit grower and public health collaborative farm worker community vaccination clinic in the fields to make sure that the people tasked with protecting our food supply chain were getting vaccines. And I know I'm not alone. I hear similar stories from communities all across our nation.